and look who we have here at the Canadian Universities and Colleges Admissions Workshop. We call Isha from Durham College. Hi Isha. Hi Ganga. Uh, Isha, we'd like our students to hear from you. Uh, something about Durham? Sure. I will be more than happy <laughs> to uh, use this platform to talk about Durham College. Um, so uh, first I would like to introduce myself to the listeners and to the audience. Um, hi, I'm Isha. I'm from Durham College. I, uh, I work as an advisor in international recruitment with Durham College. Our college is in Ontario. Uh, it's in Oshawa. Uh, we are uh, uh, one of the oldest colleges. Uh, we've just completed 50 years as an establishment. We, um, uh, in Durham region, we're uh, one of the best colleges. And uh, we have uh, different schools, School of Management and IT, uh, School Hospitality, uh, uh, School of Hospitality, and uh, uh, School of Health and Community Services. So we have several programs. Uh, we have over 140 programs under these schools and um, we have a lot of uh, Indian students uh, wanting to study at Durham and um, uh, we what, most, what do most of these students uh, uh, what programs do they choose most of them so you know uh, it's interesting because uh, these students now are aware of the programs and uh, the, the programs that we offer. So uh, from marketing to business, human resources to uh, uh, hospitality skills, culinary skills and uh, uh, addictions and mental health programs in psychology, programs in engineering, uh, computer science, uh, you know, ranging from these programs, these students want to uh, they, they want to uh, study as per their field of uh, interest interest and the background that they have they have already so the postgraduate programs that we have uh, this, these are specializations so the students who have already studied a computers uh, a, a computers degree would want to study a computer science or a data analytics so yeah we have uh, uh, programs ranging uh, you know, for everybody, I would say, um, and uh, we. If we students do not have any maths in their uh, plus two, uh, is there any option that you offer? Yes, uh, the students who have not studied maths in their grade twelfth, uh, they can opt for hospitality programs. They can opt for supply chain or marketing programs or human resources, um, contemporary web design. So there are a lot of options for students who have not studied maths in their grade 12. But students who with maths obviously have more options uh, in terms of uh, computer programming, engineering, and, uh, and so on. Yeah. So um, what are the co-op options available uh, at your uh, college, Isha? Okay. Okay, so we, uh, our college provides uh, field placements, okay, which is through uh, a medium of job fairs that we have uh, on our campus mm -hmm. twice a year, uh, once in November and once in February. So the students who study at Durham get an opportunity to meet the prospective employers and appear for interviews uh, twice a year. And uh, there is a career counseling team available on campus throughout between the working hours. Um, we give them assistance in resume writing in uh, prepare in mock interview preparations so we prepare them to get a job in Canada that's their dream destination that's what everybody tells me that they want to go and settle in Canada so we give them the opportunity to meet the employers we give them the knowledge that they need to get a job in Canada all the programs are skill-based specializations so the industry uh, based programs we call them because uh, you know these are the programs that are needed uh, to have a job in Canada so we give them all the knowledge and the skills and we also give them the opportunity to get a job and make their lives as per their dreams <laughs> okay so how is it working with Canam, uh, Isha? Would you like to tell students yes, what they should do course. and why they should come to Canam? Uh, okay, so Canam, uh, I personally uh, feel um, that Canam is a great uh, platform, is a great medium uh, for students to uh, 
pursue and to fulfill their uh, you know dreams to be uh, going to these Canadian institution and I'm not just talking about Durham but I'm talking about uh, as an education uh, institution okay as a country you guys have been amazing in uh, promoting Canada uh, you guys have uh, given uh, students uh, a lot of information already so before they come to us they already have a lot of information in terms of how is it to live in Canada what kind of opportunities they will get after they complete their programs mm -hmm. and how they can uh, make the best out of their uh, academics in terms of uh, you know, uh, uh, extracurricular activities or co-ops or field placements. So you guys actually invest time in, uh, in, in giving them information and providing information to the students beforehand, before they approach us, uh, you know, with, with, uh, with their questions. So we help them with the selection of program that they should opt for which is most suitable but you guys already prepared them to take a decision towards that direction Thanks. so that has been amazing and I I extremely uh, uh, I feel extremely happy because these guys are aware uh, what they should ask us and how they should uh, how, how they should build their careers around their studies so yeah that is that has been an amazing thing that is one thing that I really really like uh, with working uh, uh, in working with you guys and um, other thing is um, uh, the kind of students and the kind of uh, uh, you know uh, uh, people that we get uh, out the quality of, of students the quality of students out of Canam Fairs is is amazing because uh, you know again Canam is aware of the entry eligibility and the criteria that all the institutions have so you counsel you pre counsel the students accordingly so we don't have to tell them those things repetitively so yeah okay. thank that's, you thank that's you Isha. Great. that's, that's okay. great and I hope students you've been listening to Isha very carefully and you will definitely choose Durham as your choice destination for yeah. studies. Yes. Thank you. Okay. Thank you.